Hey everybody, welcome back to Sky Lounge. Here to talk about my LA Lakers. And guess what? They lose. Fucking 109 to 113 in an overtime loss against the New York Knicks at New York. This was surprisingly one of the best games I've seen in a long time. From the Lakers perspective and maybe even the New York Knicks perspective. I haven't seen the Laker boys, you know, play that kind of competitive level in a while. And Holy shit, I mean, Lonzo went off, good God, he had like, what, 17 points? I want to say 7 boards and 9 assists, um, but let's fact check super quick, because he was just on fire. You know what, 17, 8, and 6, 46 field, 46% on field goal, um, 2 steals, 1 block, and 1 turnover. And then the other fucking guy we have to talk about, the unicorn, Chris Stapps Porzingis, 37, 11, 8, 54% field goal percentage, uh, one steal, five blocks, and three turnovers. So, what does that really tell you? Yeah, he's a bit fluky on the turnovers still right now, but oh my god, those blocks were uh, those blocks were ridiculous. It was ridiculous to watch those blocks, and you just kind of think, wait, why is Lonzo a six foot six guard going against a seven foot three four, right four? What the fuck? But you know what? It, to be fair, it's a fun. It was fun to watch because they, the both teams were at each other's throats. They kept battling, and there was a stretch in the third quarter. Third quarter where, I swear to you, it was just like seven or eight possessions back to back to back to back to back to back to back. To back. They were scoring left and right. It was Kristaps going for a layup, and then Lonzo would go for a layup. Fucking Kristaps goes for a fucking three, splash. Fucking. Lonzo goes for a three, splash. It was just an incredible game. And you kind of just think, wow, you know, in a couple of years, if they develop their talent, everybody develops their talent, and, you know, everything goes right. You could see this as an NBA final. Now, I know I'm exaggerating right now, but this could potentially be an NBA final if, A, the Knicks have all the right pieces and Chris Stapps, um, you know, he leads the charge into the playoffs and, you know, gets the fucking final if there's that and then if the lakers get a great free agent and all our players start developing the right way i definitely can see this as a fucking final it would be awesome to watch that but the one player that was really disappointing last night was brand ingram unfortunately because his field goal percentage was like under 17 percent with not a lot of great awareness on the court but they'll get that shit together and they'll they'll get that shit figured out but you know until next time you know which is tomorrow the lakers are still on this long road trip they're gonna be in cleveland tomorrow against the cleveland cavaliers so let's see how that goes until next time guys you know you know where to find me fucking comment all that shit until next time fuck off